changes. Got that right. When atomic fire consumed the earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. As decades passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic, dedicated to old world values of democracy and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The NCR mobilized its army and sent it east to occupy Hoover Dam and restore it to working condition. But across the Colorado, another society had arisen under a different flag. A vast army of slaves forged from the conquest of 86 tribes, Caesar's Legion. Four years have passed since the Republic held the dam, just barely, against the Legion's onslaught. The Legion did not retreat. Across the river, it gathers strength. Campfires burn, training drums beat. Through it all, the New Vegas Strip has stayed open for business, under the control of its mysterious overseer, Mr. House and his army of rehabilitated tribals and police robots. You are a courier, hired by the Mojave Express to deliver a package to the New Vegas Strip. What seemed like a simple delivery job has taken a turn for the worse. You got what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink, dig? That doesn't make me feel any better. You've made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. From where you're kneeling, must seem like an 18 karat run of bad luck. Truth is, the game was rigged from the start. Go! Oh! Hey guys, this is KJ48 and welcome to my brand new Let's Play. So let's play Fallout New Vegas. This is part one. Uh, yeah, I got Fallout New Vegas today. It's uh, October 19th. Uh, game looks pretty cool so far. Um, it may look, the, the resolution is a little messed up right now. And the game is going to, it looks a little bit worse right now than it's going to look. What happened was I couldn't run the opening cutscene at max graphics with fraps going. Uh, but the regular game did seem to run okay with, at max graphics. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get through the beginning. Then between episodes two or three, I'm going to put the graphics back up and put the resolution up. And hopefully everything will run okay. Um, yeah, let's get to it. Caravan pack items added to your inventory. You're awake. How about that? Whoa, easy there, easy. You've been out cold a couple of days now. Why don't you just relax a second? Get your bear. Let's see what the damage is. How about your name? Can you tell me your name? My name? My name is Cage! Go to hell, old guy. I'm Doc Mitchell. Welcome to Goodstone. Now, I hope you don't mind 
But I had to go rooting around in the noggin to pull all the bits of lead out. I take pride in my needlework. You better tell me if I left anything out of place. Look at the aliasing in the background. Jaggies. Oh, I can't wait to set the settings back. Freaking fraps pisses me off. Alright, it wants to ask what I look like. Um, I'll stick with this general guy. I'll uh, change his hairstyle to... Actually, that looks pretty unique. They didn't have that in Fallout 3. I don't know. Uh, maybe. Let's see. Let's see if we can get his facial hair. Yeah, beatnik. Definitely beatnik. Um, uh, let me see what I can do with his chin, because he's got a fat chin. Uh, chin. Uh, actually, no, no. Uh, there's another way to do that. Age is good. Next. Facial hair. No, no, I'm not done. No. Hairstyle. Hair color. Customize. Tone. There's a way to make your guy look fatter or skinnier. But I thought it was shape, actually. Brown, general. General? There we go. Oh, wow. Pretty thin, I don't know. I guess it's just the way the next look, I don't know. Oh, heavy light, there we go. Much better. Yeah. That's good. Yes, I'm done. I like the hairstyle, it's pretty cool. Let me change the, uh, the audio. Yeah, voices need to go up. Oh, wait. No, master needs to go up. And I think that could stay just like that. I beat you! I know it's not a race, but I beat you! Alright, this is going to ask me for to choose my my skills. Special! Strength, perception, endurance, charisma, intelligence, agility, luck. Just like Fallout 3. Alright, uh, strength is um, melee weapon damage, uh, unarmed weapon damage. It says weapon effectiveness. I'm not sure exactly what that means, but I'm going to keep it at 5 just for now. Uh, perception, explosives, lock picking, energy weapons, accuracy, compass, range. Uh, perception basically lets you see people on the minimap, enemies on the minimap that might be sneaking up on you and stuff. And it affects uh, your explosives, lock picking, energy weapon skills, your accuracy. Uh, I'm going to leave that at 5 for now. Endurance is hit points, unarmed damage, you know, resistance, survival. Uh, charisma, I don't care about. I think we all know what charisma means. Whatever. Intelligence. Now, intelligence is very important. You see the little bottom thing here? Skill points. Every time you level, you get skill points to put into your skills. And the more intelligence you have, the more, the more skill points you have for that. So I'll put that up to 7. Also, medicine and repair are nice, and science is pretty good, too. Agility. Um, I'm going to be a guy that uses guns, and this is a major uh, thing for guns. It also gives you more action points for when you're in VATS, uh, and I will put that up to 7. And then luck is just like a basic overall skill, you know. Uh, some folks claim not to believe in luck, but when you lose in a duel, you hear them say, that lucky son of a gun. Uh, it, it, it does a little bit to all your skills, and, and crit the critical hits are nice. I don't know what enemy mishaps are. I guess maybe them shooting themselves by accident or their gun jamming or something. I don't know. I'll put that up one. Now, the, now they're asking me for a review. This is exactly what I did in Fallout 3, and I think it's going to work in this one as well. Yeah, that's a pretty standard score there, but after what you've been through, I'd say that's great news. Well, we know your vitals are good, but that don't mean them bullets didn't leave you nuttered in a big one and drop it. What do you say you take a seat in my couch and we go through a couple of questions? See if your dog can still bark. Now he's going to give me a test for my skills. Um, if I have a chance, I'll explain it to you. All right. I'm going to say a word. I want you to say the first thing. Okay, yeah. 
dog. Okay, now basically what he's doing is, you get skills in this game, you get like a, a little handful, handful of skills, and you can tag three of them before you go out into the world. He's giving me a psych test to see what I would, you know, be best at, um, or what I want my character to be, and then he's going to tag the skills for me, but at the end of this he'll allow me to change that if I want. So really these, these answers mean nothing. It's just like that test you took in the beginning of Fallout 3 when you were a kid. I forget the name of it. Alright, dog, what do I think of? Feed. House. Shelter. Night. Uh, shroud. Bandit. Crush. Light. Inspiration. Mother. Caretaker. Okay. Now I got a few statements. I want you to tell me how much they sound like something you'd say. First one. Conflict just ain't in my nature. No opinion. I'm not really sure what that means. I meant. ain't given to relying on others for support. I agree. I'm always fixing to be the center of attention. Oh, I strongly agree. Who doesn't want to be the center I'm of attention? I'm slow to embrace new ideas. Mmm, you know what? I kind of agree with that. I charge in to deal with my problems head on. Absolutely agree. Well, not really. Sometimes I'll sneak almost around. Done here. These pictures are stupid. I what can't tell what they look have like. A look at this? Tell me what you see. I don't know. I, I, I did this before through my first play walkthrough, or my first Let's Play you guys can't see because it, it was too laggy. Uh, whatever, a broken chain. Okay. How about this one? Yeah, work of art. Last one. That looks like two people high-fiving each other or something. I don't know. Uh, yeah, bearded man. Well, that's all she wrote. I don't have nothing to compare it to, so maybe you'd better just have yeah, a look at the results. He gives me a chance to change them. All seems right to you. All right, I'm at the end of my uh, time, so I will be right back with part two. Be right back. <laughs>